nice instrument. I played a trumpet in a war a long time ago. You should have seen those walls come down. How'd you get in here? You make it sound as if I'd been away. The past is always nearby, especially here. I suppose you're going to tell me now that you are the, the spirit of Christmas past? You said it, not I. It's not going to work, you know. I know who you are, so why don't you just go back to your little silly bookstore, Maribel? Not much of a bookstore anymore. I said get out. Outside! All right. Outside. What are you doing? What's going on here? Had enough? Yes, I've had enough. Thank you very much. Get me back inside. Sorry to be so dramatic, but you did bring it on yourself. Jack said visitation's not freezing to death. What is it you want? The past wants only to be remembered. I remember the past very well without your help. Thank you. Do you remember it? Really? Or just those parts you pick out for yourself? Do you know this place? I know this place. The county orphanage. I guess we've come to a costume party. Guess again. Well, people have been dressed like this for 40 years. You're getting warmer. They're coming, they're coming. Boys, get ready, everyone get ready. Ah, here comes Mrs. Tiding. She runs the place. No, nope, it's impossible. She's dead. She wasn't when you were here. They are the best of the lot, Mr. Brewster. Well behaved, intelligent, deserving. That's excellent, Mrs. Tidings, excellent. Of course, uh, whoever we choose for our apprentice will have to be able to learn the business from the ground up. Oh, I'm sure every one of these boys would be more than satisfactory. Who's that at the back of the room? Oh, that's Benedict Slade. Where? He hasn't been here very long. When his parents died, he was passed around among aunts and uncles. Then they turned him over to us. So skinny. Why didn't you feed me better? How is he with his hands? He fights a lot. Has he ever used tools? No. More from anger than skill. Well, at least that's a beginning. Oh, Mr. Brewster, I don't think you'd be advised to take that boy. Excuse me, Mrs. Tidings. I'd much rather do something for someone who needs rather than someone who just wants. Please bring him over to us, would you? Thank you. 